now I'm gonna make a habitat, like a place for frogs and other things to spend winter in. You know how they hibernate, it's called hibernaculum. And I think I'm gonna situate it right here. First I found some wood pellets that were for free. And <clears throat> I'm gonna put wood pellets here, two of them. These are heavy. And I'm gonna cover them with soil, make like a rock garden over it. So this will be the entrance to my, to my hibernaculum. Then cover this with a soil, make a rock garden, and um, make like two entrances on the front and put some rocks. I'm gonna, sorry about that. And I'm gonna put these rocks between the pallet, between the two by fours. Create like little spaces. I'm gonna fill that with more rocks. And now, uh, more rocks. The rocks are gonna create like little spaces where the frogs can hide. Just put a little bit of soil there. of space there. I don't want it to be like space only. I want this to be only partial space. So now I'm gonna put those top boards on here. And there are openings so the things can come through. Part of that fabric that is the under layer for the pond. Just to cover some of the holes. And now I'm gonna put a little bit of soil on top of this. And uh, the other palette, second palette. A little bit bigger. That's okay. And then put some rocks and soil inside. A little bit of soil. Okay. 
Okay, so we're gonna put some rocks here on the top. Let's put them here. Gonna create a lot of living space for those little critters. Natural habitat for them. And there is like a passage from the bottom to the top so the little critters can pass. You can go here on the back if you want. And now I'm gonna here on the back. It's always yeah. uh -huh. it's always good to have a help. Perfect. All right. Yeah, perfect. So, okay, got that. I'm gonna cover it with um, some of the palm liner. It doesn't have to be perfect. Some of the pond rubber left over from the pond and I'm gonna try, try to cover the spaces between the wood. Actually, you can start putting this on the top here, probably with a shovel. We're gonna cover everything now with the soil. Oh! shelter and just want to make it a little more even okay. I gotta leave now just gonna make <clears throat> the entrance to the hibernaculum on the front these rocks and then one on the top this is one entrance and <coughs> Make another one here on the other side. Okay. 
looking for rocks. Access. The frogs are so excited, they just keep making noises. I'm just gonna harden that soil. sticks cover them with soil that will help with erosion control and it will keep moisture under the soil because obviously this is gonna be naturally a dry spot Sorry. And I think I'm gonna just use this wire as an extra um erosion control tool here as I don't want those low entrances to be um, covered with soil so once I plant plants uh, they will be able to root themselves and hang on to those metal wires and uh, prevent the soil from falling down Here. I love time. Time is such an awesome herb. So, um, after a few hours, we moved all the soil from there. Here. Now I'm gonna plant uh, different plants on the low hill and the frogs were so happy that we were building a home for them. I'm just putting finishing touches here. Probably I will plant white clover. We're cleaning up the whole area. 